welcome back to another unboxing. Today we're unboxing another nine pack for April King of the Nines tournament exclusively for our Patreon members. So head on over to patreon.com slash summers raceway so you can check out all the cool races happening over there. All right, guys, without further ado, let's take a closer look at this nine pack because it's awesome. So this is the first Adventure Force nine pack that we're unboxing and it's made by Mistow or Maisto, sorry, Maisto, and they created Adventure Force exclusively for Walmart. So this is the first time I, honestly, I'm kind of excited because a lot of the Hot Wheels 9 packs that I've been seeing are a lot of like the same cars that we have or things I've, you know, I've seen all the time. So changing it up a bit, I am super stoked about actually unboxing this. So without further ado, let's get it unboxed. And just like that, it's unboxed. But before, I want to take a closer look at the actual case itself because it's pretty cool. It's got featuring all these different manufacturers on it. And you can see the closer look about Adventure Force. And the back's pretty similar too. So it's all the different kinds of manufacturers. But I want to just look at that real quickly. But the best part is Let's look at these cars. I mean, honestly, they're super cool. I just love how different they are compared to everything else we've been unboxing. So I'm gonna put them to the side and we're gonna go car by car. First up, ooh, we got like a beetle, beetle. Let's see, does this have a name on it? Ooh, that is super sparkly. It's so hard to tell on the actual camera. Give me one second. Let me get a closer look at this. And see if I can see. I can't find a name. It's like just so sparkly. As you can see on the camera, it is so hard to make out what it is, but it's a Volkswagen, Volkswagen Beetle. And it's nice and yellow. This is so cute. So first we got our Volkswagen Beetle and I did actually know what that was too. Next up. Ooh, we got a Chevy. Let's see. Oh, we can see the same. It's a 2015 Chevrolet Colorado. It looks kind of worn in, which is pretty awesome, like especially right here with the detailing and right here how everything's a little bit worn in. That's cool. I do love how they have the little logos on the front of them. They look more like a realistic car, which is pretty awesome in my opinion. Next up. Okay, number one, can we talk about the paint? I know I haven't even talked about the name yet, but oh, look how beautiful that shine and shimmer is. Oh, goodness. All right, let's see. This is called Rosewood. That was super easy. Look how absolutely beautiful this car is. It kind of reminds me of like a charger almost. But oh, I can't get over that gold paint. Oh my gosh, that is like beautiful. As you can tell, I have such a soft spot for shimmer. Oh, it kind of looks like the theming blends in together with the orange and the yellow. Next up, we got this or Oh, again, do you see the shimmers? They are so beautiful. This is, let's get it. Porsche. Cayman S. Porsche Cayman S. Oh, this Porsche. And then again, there's the little Porsche symbol there right there in the very front. But this orange shimmery paint is just so beyond beautiful. I'm obsessed. I really am obsessed. Next up. Let's see if we get this to focus. There we go. Oh, look at this. Good luck charm. Beautiful. Oh, we got another Porsche. Let's focus in on that. There we go. We got another Porsche. This is a Porsche taken. I would totally said that wrong. Tacon Turbo S. Again, that shimmer is absolutely beautiful. It just really does a lot for the paint itself. And I like how simple and like just nice these cars look, honestly. Next up, ooh, 
fire and rescue. Fun fact, Malia now knows how to say firefighter or any type of fire truck, anything like that. So every time she sees a fire truck, she's like, firefighters, <laughs> which is really cute. Oh, we got a Jeep, by the way. So this is, let's get this photo, oh, it's upside down. A Jeep Gladiator. Fun fact, I always wanted a Jeep and I actually wanted a Jeep Liberty for the longest time. I don't know why. I just like had an obsession with them. And I remember growing up, we had a Jeep for a little while. It wasn't a Liberty. I don't remember honestly which model it was, but we traded in for a Camry. And at the time, I thought that was the most devastating moment of my life. I was like, why would you get rid of our Jeep? But Camrys are nice and reliable next up who look at this this is called oh lead foot or lead foot lead foot i think it's lead foot i can read as you can tell here's a nice matte army green color really pretty i'm not a big fan of the actual body of the car the body style of it but you know teach their own and there's the black flames right there on the side. All right, guys. Next up, we got a red butte right here. That's a Lamborghini symbol. I'm getting better with these, by the way. Oh, I was wrong. Oh, no. It's a Corvette. Okay. It's a 2020 Chevrolet Corvette Stingray Coupe. Z51. Whew, that is a mouthful. Oh, that is a totally a Corvette symbol too. I don't know why I thought it was. Oh my gosh. But I always love any type of exotic light cars. Anything that looks very fun like this. I love them in red. And I really like how it has like the fake little headlights and everything. Super cool. Last but certainly not least, we got a garbage truck. Well, I don't know if this is actually like a garbage truck, but I like to say it is. All right, let's see if we can see the name. Oh, there, Street Sweeper. Oh, it's a Street Sweep. There we go. Oh, when I turn it around, you can see a little, oh my gosh, all the little cleaning tools here on the side. I remember when I was in college, we'd always have you know, there are certain days that we couldn't park on certain sides of the road so they can clean them. And I always was really horrible at knowing when I was allowed to park where. And I got a lot of parking tickets because of it. Very cool. All right, guys, please leave comments down below. Which one was your favorite car from this nine pack? Honestly, I think it's super cool how different these types of cars are. I personally, huh, I got to go with the gold guy. This one right here. I think that one's just so beautiful. I love how the paint is, especially reflecting off the light. I think it's so gorgeous. But please let us know. What, I mean, what is your favorite car here? There's some really awesome cars. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And don't forget... Every Sunday on Patreon, we have our King of the Nines tournament going on. So definitely check it out because it's actually really, really cool. If you guys are in a position to support Summer's Raceway, consider being a Patreon at patreon.com slash Summer's Raceway for exclusive content. If you're watching us on Facebook, don't forget to like our page. If you're watching us on YouTube, don't forget to smash that subscribe button. The best part about it, it's free. Thank you guys again so much for watching. And we will see you guys soon with another unboxing. Bye.